Hi there, I'm Flappers the Falcon with my buddy Patrick the Peregrine. Today we're going to learn all about the life cycle of a falcon. No, not the bicycle of a falcon. We usually don't get them in our size. But we are going to talk about the falcon's life cycle from the beginning, when we're just eggs. Do you know what you call a baby falcon who stays out in the heat for too long? A fried egg. Boo, that was bad. A better one would have been, what do you call a scrambled falcon egg at a diner? A cheap breakfast, you know, like a bird chirping, but y you're not laughing? Well, I guess this joke is for the birds. On to the falcon's life cycle. Peregrine falcons usually live around 10 years. One of the oldest known peregrine falcons was a 17-year-old male from Boston who fathered 50 chicks. Talk about needing a good college fund. Most peregrine falcons nest when they are 2 to 3 years old. Nesting is when birds pair up, move into a nest, and lay eggs. Peregrine falcons mate for life, meaning that a male and female falcon will stay together as long as they live. The only time a peregrine falcon finds a new mate is if their current one passes away. Just like how you might want to impress someone that you think is cute, falcons want to impress their dates. They have some sweet moves to get the attention of their potential mate. They will bow their heads, fly in special ways, scrape or dig a special spot in a nest, and beak, which means they playfully nip at the other falcon. These activities are called pair bonding, and they strengthen the relationship between two falcons. Once the falcons have a relationship, the male falcon lets the female falcon choose the nest site, and she starts to make a scrape, which means that she digs out a spot for her eggs. Right before they lay any eggs, female falcons will become very tired and stay alone in their nest. Then, in early spring, she will lay three to five eggs. A group of eggs is called a clutch. The eggs are pinkish brown and two inches in length, a little smaller than a chicken egg. Eggs have to be incubated. Incubation is when parent falcons sit on the eggs to keep them warm. Falcons don't start hard incubation, or sitting on the eggs all the time, until the second to last egg is laid, so that all the eggs can develop and hatch around the same time. In order to make sure the chicks develop properly, Falcons will turn the eggs every so often and then pull, push, roll, or put the eggs in a small close place to sit on them. Our pen pals at the University of California Berkeley call this and fluffling. Incubation lasts for 28 days, almost one month. The female does most of the incubation, but the male falcon will do his fair share of sitting too, to let the female stretch her wings. Stay tuned to find out all about how eggs hatch.